So the words of wisdom for today is this. Speak your life into existence. And the first question I'm going to ask you is, do you do this? And I don't care what you said. I hate to break it to you. You do speak your life into existence. It's just you make a decision whether it's going to be on a positive angle or a negative angle. But that's what we're going to cover in today's video. I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself because I'm really looking forward to talking about this. But just in case you didn't know, my name is Rob Moore, award-winning author, leadership expert, and founder of LeadersWhoShine.com. And I help people show up, step out, and shine no matter where they are or what they do to create more leaders in the world. And I want to welcome you back to my Words of Wisdom series. This is episode number 29, Speak Your Life Into Existence. And the reason why I chose this topic of something that I wanted to shoot a video about and add to this series is because I'm always, like when I'm putting these videos together, I'm trying to think about, you know, my daily interactions with people and like what kind of advice you know, like what's the number one piece of advice that I could give this person or these individuals that I feel can make the biggest impact for their situation right now? And I really got to thinking about, you know, uh, how people speak, you know, because people, they don't realize it. They're, they really are speaking their life into existence and language patterns and how you speak is so important. How you speak to yourself in your head is so important and how you speak in the outside world is even more important because what you speak actually happens. You know, I talked about this in several videos. You know, I talked a little bit about it in my in my Words of Wisdom series episode where I talked about the power of words. Um, I talked about it on another video where probably on a, on a few other videos where I talked about how the mind is like a computer and if there's certain things you want it to do, there's certain things that you have to do with your computer. So if you want to go on the internet, you have to type in certain things give it certain commands and it will go on the internet for you. And then if there's certain things you want to find on the internet, you have to type in some other things and give it to some commands. And this is just how life works as well. You know, there's so many ways, you know, that we create the life that we have. And the problem is most people are not aware of these powers that we have. And, and most people just don't know. So I ask you this question. You know, do you speak your life into existence? Yes, you do. I want you to think about some of the phrases that you say. Like, if you constantly say that today is going to be a great day, what happens to your day? Just think about that. I want you to think about some of the phrases that you say repeatedly. Not the phrases that you say once in a while, because the things that you say once in a while, they don't manifest that quick. But I want you to think about some things that you say every single day. And if you notice that those things that you say every single day, they're actually true for you. And the reason why they're true for you is because they are things that you have said so many times to yourself that you now believe them. And once you believe something, it manifests in your life. So if you're the type of person that gets up you know, start your day off talking about, man, I'm so tired. Guess what? You're creating circumstances for you to be tired and to continue to be tired. If you say that your day is okay, guess what? You're creating and you're attracting an okay day. So one of the things that I did early on, you know, in my life. And it wasn't something that I was aware of. I just did it, you know, like I just like one day, like, and I talk about it in my book, Show Up, Step Out and Shine. You know, one, like when I like realize that I had an opportunity to change my life and really have a good solid career with a very good company, you know, I, I, wanted that so bad and I became so hungry for it that I changed my whole complete personality. I changed my whole complete outlook on life and I made a decision that I was going to have a fan 
fantastic day all the time. And like when people would ask me how I'm doing, I wouldn't just say I'm doing fantastic. I would say I'm doing fantastic. And like some people would like see that response and they just wouldn't believe it. But I made that decision that that's how I'm going to be. And still to this day, I mean, I don't always use fantastic now. Now I use all types of things, but still to this day, I, you'll never hear me say something negative about how my day is going. If you ask me how my day is going, I like, like good to me, like I'm not even going to say I'm having a good day. I'm not even going to say I'm having a good day because to me, a good day is like an average day. I like my, my favorite top phrase now is like, somebody's like, how you doing? I'm, I'm golden. I love that. That's like my number one phrase. I say I'm golden. Sometimes I mix it up. I say I'm phenomenal. I'm spectacular. I'm fantastic. I'm terrific. Um, there was there was this other one that I said. Oh man. Oh, I said I, <laughs> I really, really, really like this. I just forget to say it sometimes. Like sometimes I'll say I'm platinum. I'm platinum. So here's one of the. So if we. I want you to think about what I'm telling you on this video, right? I want you to really think about this. You know, what you speak actually happens in your life if you speak it enough. So you're always speaking your life into existence. So if you're looking at your life and there's things going on in your life that you do not like and that you want to change, I challenge you to work on changing your language patterns. So like, Let's say that you used to always like say when somebody asks you how you're doing, let's say you used to always say that you, you know, you're having a bad day. Like let's just say, for example, that's what you used to do. So guess what? Because you said that so many times, you actually do have a bad day every day. So this is what I want you to do. Now that you're watching this video, now that you're aware of your power and how you speak your life into existence, this is what I want you to do. I want you to start ignoring what you see. I want you to start ignoring what you hear and I want you to focus on things being the way that you want them to be. So you used to say that your day is bad. I want you to start saying that you're having an incredible day. I'm having a great day. I'm having a phenomenal day. And I want you to continue to say that. And now since you're just starting to change these, you know, these, um, these patterns in your in your, you know, in your mind and stuff like that, things don't always change on the outside quickly. Sometimes they do, but they don't always do it. So when you start to shift your energy and you start to say that you're having an incredible day, you're having a phenomenal day, you're having a fantastic day, even th things may continue to happen in your day that make it seem like you're having a bad day. But this is what I want you to do. This is what I challenge you to do. I challenge you to ignore those things and I want you to still keep that positive energy and I want you to say, you know what, I'm having a fantastic day. I'm having an incredible day. Still. And let things happen. Let things happen that appear to be bad and look to be bad. But I still want you to say, I want you to ignore those things that you see and I want you to say, I'm having a fantastic day. I'm having a fantastic day. A, a, uh, you know, somebody's like, yo, Rob, man, man, somebody just called out tonight. I want you to say, okay, what we got to do to handle that? Who can we call in? What do we got to do to make, to, to fix that? Well, how's your day going so far? Man, I'm still having a fantastic day. Let's just get this done. That's how I want you to like attack things in your life. And I promise you start to do this. I challenge you start to do this and you will see changes in your life. Now, once again, I've said this on previous videos. If you know me personally, if you know me outside of these videos, when have I ever said that I'm having a bad day? When have I ever said that I'm having an okay day or even just a good day? I just don't do it because I want certain things to happen in my life. I want my day to be a certain way. So I demand for my day to be a phenomenal day. I demand a fantastic day. So that's what I get because that's what I demand. I speak my life into existence and I challenge you to do the same. So 
that's the words of wisdom for today. I'm going to cut this video right here and I'm going to encourage you to like this video. I encourage you to share this video. I encourage you to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also feel free to comment on this video. If you have any questions or concerns or anything along those lines, please let me know. And if you have not already done so, go over to leaderswhoshine.com and pick up it's a really cool gift that I have for you that I think is going to add even more value to your life. And I'm looking forward to shooting the next video. Hey, my name is Rob Moore reminding you to show up, step out and shine. Now is your time. So make it shine. Thank you very much and have a fantastic day. I'll catch you later.